Hi friends and fellow flute enthusiasts. In this episode of Johnny's Flute Reviews, we're going to be looking at John Norris's new flute line, the Pathfinder series. The Pathfinder series come in five keys, A minor, G minor, F sharp minor, E minor, and D minor. So it goes from higher to lower. So what I have in my hand here, this is the A minor. These are all made out of Eastern red cedar. So the wood grain will vary quite a bit from red, pink, you might see some uh, stripes of white or cream color in there as well. Um, and that's common for Eastern red cedar. So this one is the A minor. It's the smallest one in the series. Uh, feels very comfortable, is great for new flute players. Um, a minor it has become one of the most popular keys amongst uh, flute enthusiasts. The A minor Pathfinder sounds like this. Moving over to the G minor, um, as a comparison, uh, a little bit larger. Um, finger spacing is a little bit further apart. Uh, that's very common uh, as you get uh, to lower keys of flutes, and you'll see a bigger difference once we get further into this uh, series. So this is the G minor, uh, again made from Eastern Red Cedar, and it sounds like this. So moving right along, we get to F sharp and just a small change in the size of these flutes. So this is the F sharp minor, a little bit larger and a little bit lower than the G minor. And next up we have the E minor. Oh, so I want to compare these. So the E minor, uh, you'll see there's quite a bit of a jump between the sizes here now. Um, and this goes, um, this goes down a couple of keys from F sharp to E. And this starts to get quite a bit more, uh, more mellow tone and uh, lower sound. This is the E minor. So now we get to the D minor. This is the largest in the series. Uh, the D minor has a larger bore. It's a little bit bigger around. Uh, also made from Eastern Cedar, of course. Uh, you can see there's quite a bit of difference now jumping from uh, the next key. So the D minor sounds like this. And again, you know, as we get to a larger flute, the finger spacing, though, 
Uh, I have seen finger spacing be quite a bit further apart. Uh, John has done a really good job about keeping the, um, the three holes together. So for the top hand and the bottom hand, there's a space between here. So it still feels quite comfortable. So the whole position is, uh, is quite comfortable. This is the D minor. So from the A minor all the way to the D minor, you can see there's been a gradual um, change um, and growth between the, uh, the two, um, but compared next to each other, there's quite a bit of difference. If you have small hands, it's recommended that you start with somewhere in the A or G. Uh, if you can, if you have a little bit larger hand or experience with a woodwind instrument and you're used to kind of stretching uh, your fingers apart a little bit more, then you could probably handle something like an E or even a D minor. Um, each one has its own uh, sound, and that's the beautiful thing about the Native American flute. So these are, again, the Pathfinder flutes uh, made by John Norris. He's been making flutes for well over 20 years uh, and makes a lot of exotic flutes. I have several other flutes of his in my collection. So thanks for watching this episode of Johnny's Flute Reviews. Uh, stay tuned as we unravel and uncover more flutes from my collection and others. Mm -hmm.